In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Above all powers, above all kings, above all nature, and all created things. For our good night message on this Good Friday of the 29th of March, 2024, Broadcasting from the Salesian Pontifical University, Rome, Italy, by your servant, Father Eustace Siame, a Salesian of Don Bosco. We listen to this encouraging and strengthening message entitled, Glorying in the Cross of Jesus, a Good Friday Message of Hope. Of all wealth and treasures of the earth. Measure what you were crucified and laid behind the stone. On this Good Friday, as we reflect upon the cross of Jesus Christ, let us find strength and encouragement in the profound message of hope that it brings. In the gospel that we have taken this afternoon. From John chapter 18 verse 1 to chapter 19 verse 42 of our passion narrative, we witness the agonizing journey of our Savior towards his crucifixion. It is a passage filled with despair, suffering, and unimaginable pain. Yet in the midst of darkness, there shines a glimmer of hope, the glory found in the cross. The cross was not just an instrument of torture, it became a symbol of love, redemption, and ultimate victory. Through his sacrifice on the cross, Jesus demonstrated his unconditional love for humanity and offered us forgiveness and salvation. He bore our sins upon himself so that we could be set free from their burden and experience eternal life. In John chapter 18 verse 1 to chapter 19 verse 42, we see Jesus willingly submitting to God's plan despite knowing the immense suffering that awaited him. He could have chosen to escape or avoid such agony, but instead he embraced his mission with unwavering determination. This act reveals his incredible strength and unyielding faith in God's purpose. We too can draw strength and inspiration from Jesus' example. When faced with trials and tribulations in our own lives, let us remember that through every hardship lies an opportunity for growth and transformation. Just as Jesus endured the cross for a greater purpose, so too can we find meaning in our struggles. Furthermore, as we contemplate the events leading up to Calvary, let us also recognize that even in our darkest moments, God is present with us. Despite Jesus' agony on the cross, his trust in God remained steadfast. He cried out, It is finished, signaling not defeat but rather the fulfillment of God's plan for redemption. This message of hope reminds us that no matter how bleak our circumstances may seem, there is always light at the end of the tunnel. Just as Jesus emerged victorious from the cross, we too can experience triumph over adversity with God by our side. So dear friends, let us glory in the cross of Jesus Christ. Let us find hope and strength in his sacrifice, knowing that through him we are offered a new beginning filled with love, grace, and eternal life. May this Good Friday message inspire us to face our own challenges with unwavering faith and trust in God's plan for our lives. Wishing you a blessed Good Friday, filled with hope and renewed strength. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. And may Almighty God bless you, the Father and the Son 
and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Good night as a dreams. Same to you, Father. Of all powers, above all kings, above all nature and all created things, above all wisdom and all the ways of man, you were here before. Of all kingdoms, above all thrones, above all wonders the world has ever known, above all wealth and treasures of the earth, there's no way to measure what i mm-hmm.